cell system in the human body, uh, very simple connecting in a locomotor apparatus. Apparatus when present few, two or three system uh, uh, together. For example, um, systems, uh, skeletal system, articular system of joints and muscular uh, system, muscles uh, system um, in Together, it will be apparatus. Apparatus when present three system together. Locomotor apparatus because locomotion is a uh, changing uh, of the human body in a uh, space. Yeah. Next of all, it's a splunk knowledge. Splunk knowledge or in a modern uh, terminology, it's a visceral systems. Visceral system it's a only digestive system, respiratory, urinary system, and genital systems. Uh, I replay genital system, not reproductive system. It's a big mistake when uh, genital system have name reproductive system. Why? Because uh, not only reproductive function present in the genital system. Please remember this is moment. So uh, long time endocrine system, uh, lymphoid, lymphoid organs will be present in splanchnology, but now present uh, in a modern uh, classification, it's an integral system first. Uh, integral systems first, including uh, endocrine glands, uh, cardiovascular system and lymphoid organs. Uh, why it's an integral uh, system first? Maybe you can uh, write in, in uh, uh, our chat what is same for these uh, three parts of the integral systems first. Uh, really, it will be liquid, yeah? It's a hormone in the endocrine glands, uh, cardiovascular system, it's a uh, uh, blood and lymph in the lymph organs. Uh, it's the same for integral systems uh, first. Next of all, it's uh, uh, five parts. Uh, it's a uh, will be integral system second, integral system second, uh, including system nervous system, uh, uh, sense organ and uh, integumentum commune, or uh, it doesn't mean skin and breast and. Uh, what is organ in this is, uh, structure, in this is slides, and this is, for example, uh, in your opinion, the biggest organ? Yes, students. Skin, skin. Skin, yes, yeah, really. Skin, it's the biggest organ in a human body, and in a skin, uh, it's a more two kilograms and more two uh, meter quadrates. Uh, uh, and um, have very important uh, moment in uh, connecting uh, with external, you understand, yeah? Next of all, it's a locomotor apparatus. Locomotor apparatus, I will play, it's uh, bones, joints, and muscles. Uh, as a variant, it's a locomotor system, a musculoskeletal system in English. Uh, for these systems present um, same uh, location in the classification, some parts, for example, uh, in a bone, joints and muscle present uh, head, uh, muscle, bones and joints of the head, of the trunk, of the upper uh, extremity and lower extremity. And uh, three biggest um, uh, Scienty, uh, it's a part of the human anatomy. It's a osteology, arthrology, and myology. It's a for uh, studying this is moment. First of all, it's a really will be bones, big parts of the bones of the human body, and all bones of the human body. It's an organ. For example, a very small uh, bone. For example, hyoid bone location in the neck. Uh, and uh, other bones, it's an organ. What does it mean organ? It's an all structure in the human body with vascularization, innervation, uh, function and structure. Uh, in uh, the finish two uh, or three uh, weeks, 
you will uh, understand the structure of the 206 bones or 206 organs in the human body. These organs have uh, some function and uh, location. Uh, for example, in a uh, skeleton system present axial skeleton and appendicular skeleton. Next of all, I replay in a website, uh, anatom.ca, in a special bonds, I will send to you in the chat now this information and you can visit this, this website and download free part, uh, some information about uh, X-ray examination and other examination of the uh, diagnostic methods. And here, for example, you look in a skull, yeah? And uh, in the first lecture in human anatomy, I uh, told about a very important moment. It's a sinus of the uh, skull, uh, frontal sinus, uh, sphenoid sinus, etmoidal uh, sinuses or cellulas and maxillary sinus, maxillary sinus as a name uh, used name uh, scientist who opening this moment, uh, this structure. It's a hymer pasus, a sinus. Uh, uh, as a moment, uh, why uh, very important to understand who opened hymer? Because inflammation of the maxillary sinus, it will be um, disorders with name of the uh, hymeritis. Uh, next of all, it's a joints in a human body present uh, number two, yes? Or as a moment, it's a uh, uh, joints, two types of the joints. It will be next uh, lecture of the human anatomy and I replay uh, very important when you will be understand what is structure in the uh, joints uh, will present uh, in a, uh, some diagnostic methods. Muscles, how many muscles for your, uh, what is your opinion about how many muscles in a human body? 639. Uh, more than 600 uh, or uh, 626 as a uh, moment, yes? And in the finish, uh, in the first part of the human anatomy, in the finish you will, uh, very good if you uh, have uh, big portion information and understanding uh, more than 1,000 organs. Why? 206 uh, bones, more than 100 uh, joints and more than one, uh, 600 uh, bones, uh, muscles, sorry. And together it will be more than uh, near uh, 1,000 organs. I replay uh, one bones, it's uh, organs, one joints, it's uh, organs, and one muscles, uh, muscle, it's uh, organ because have uh, structure function, uh, innervation and vascularization, okay? Next of all, you will study in uh, alimentary system. Alimentary system or digestive system is the digestive tract and uh, it's very important for you uh, for understanding what is uh, ways for the <coughs> food present in a human uh, organism. And in the finish, uh, it's uh, some uh, structure in the uh, last part of the digestive system. Why number four? Well, because for digestive tract, it's a very uh, good if you remember uh, a rule of the four, four uh, digestive tracts. First of all, it's a digestive tract, uh, two organs in a digestive system in a starting, in a finish, uh, consist of with two parts. It's an oral cavity in a, and in a rectum or proctus. Next of all, number three, uh, number three, it's a three parts present for all uh, organs in the digestive tracts with tubal form. For example, pharynx, esophagus, <laughs> small intestine, and large intestine. And um, between um, 
or in a line uh, 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 near digestive uh, tract and respiratory tract in a, a start in present, uh, lymphoid structure, lymphoid structure uh, in a tonsil, uh, pharyngeal tonsil, tubular uh, tonsil, pa palatine uh, tonsils, and lingual tonsils. Together, it's a six tonsils uh, in a uh, oropharynx, and uh, this structure very important for uh, immune uh, uh, activity of the uh, human organism. Next of all, it's a respiratory system. Respiratory system have big portion in a five uh, parts, and for example, it's a five lobes in the right and left part of the lungs. Next of all, uh, next uh, it's a a uh, very important classification of the bronchioles and bronchus in the lungs. Um, you will study it when uh, will be, will be uh, parts of the splanchnology. Number six, urinary system. Urinary system, um, differences male and female, but in the urinary system, number six, because only six organs present in the urinary system. It's a uh, two kidneys, two ureters, one uh, urinary bladder, and one uretra. In the male and female, it's a different size because uh, in a different location. Number seven, genital system. Not uh, correct when used uh, reproductive system. I replace this, this information. Uh, and uh, only reproductive system is correct for uh, uh, understanding this is moment. Next of all, um, different methods very good for studying human anatomy. For example, here it's a genital organs. Some videos I um, uh, I uh, told about this moment uh, and sent uh, to the chat where you can find some portion of the video and uh, some uh, structure in it. Uh, genitals, male and female structure, uh, some organs uh, have uh, same and uh, you will study, in, for example, where allocate tastes or, uh, or his ovary and uh, other moments. Um, I stopped in uh, uh, this moment uh, because uh, very good if you uh, will find uh, not only Latin uh, languages, or Latin terminology for some organs. Why? Uh, because if uh, you will understand Greek language, uh, Latin language name, English name, uh, and Ukraine and Russia, for example, uh, terms, you uh, uh, study in five languages in a one time. And uh, uh, when you understand in more uh, words in a, uh, one language, you can use in a practice too. And some disorders, for example, orchitis, uh, inflammation of the testes, uh, colpitis, inflammation of the serous membrane of the vagina. Vagina in Latin language, but in Greek, it will be uh, colpus. And uh, for understanding names, different disorders, it's uh, three variant. One uh, variant, it's uh, when you understand a Latin language uh, name in a Latin. Next, uh, it's may present uh, name disorders uh, connecting with Greek uh, name, this is organs. And second variant, it's a uh, scientist who opens this is, uh, structure. Uh, uh, for example, we talked about uh, gymor uh, sinus. Here it's a fallopian tube, for example. Fallopian tube, it's a uh, um, uterine tube, and uh, as a moment in the Greek, it's a salping, salping gaitis, inflammation of the fallopian tube. Uh, big uh, and uh, long way for understanding human anatomy. Next of all, uh, next moment, it's endocrine glands. Um, very important, not endocrine system. Uh, endocrine system, it will be in the physiology in the after 
one years, but now in a human anatomy, it's a eight, number eight, eight uh, structure in the uh, endocrine glands, pituitary glands, uh, pineal glands, pineal body, thyroid glands, parathyroid glands, suprarenal glands, and, and adrenal glands. But Endocrine glands, it's a not only glands, it's a may present um, in the endocrine system, some structure with uh, some cells, but uh, without uh, all organs, not endocrine. It's may present only cells or, for example, uh, as a moment in a, uh, some structure, for example, in the kidneys present uh, some cells with chemical uh, product uh, and it's very important in a uh, endocrine uh, function. Next of all, uh, cardiovascular uh, systems. Uh, first variant, it's very popular ver version. Uh, it's a heart, uh, arteries and veins. One variant, one, two, three in a cardiovascular system. Next, <clears throat> heart, vessels, and blood. It's a, a, a second uh, number three. And third number three, it's a heart with blood, vessels, and lymph. Lymph, it's two uh, star parts of the cardiovascular system. Uh, please remember. Three, three, and three together into number nine. Number nine. Uh, and very simple for remembering, uh, it's when you uh, remember cardiovascular system, it's a blood vessels, artery, blood, uh, vascular plexuses. It's a vascular different uh, plexuses, arterial, venous, and other capillary veins, uh, lymphatic vessels, lymph, and in a finish here present heart, but uh, it's a, uh, I think not correct when in a finish heart, yeah? Because all uh, variants in the chart was uh, with heart in the starting, yeah? And you understand when um, problem with heart, uh, not uh, really good with, uh, all cardiovascular system. And uh, in the organism, for example, cardiovascular system, it's a, some region in a one country. Next one, in a country present some uh, regions with uh, different location in this is region, it will be organs, it will be heart. Tissue in this is, uh, organs, it's uh, may present same with CT. CT is a tissue in a heart, it's a uh, cardial uh, muscle. And uh, in uh, this uh, tissue present uh, some cardiomyocyte or in a molecular um, uh, level, uh, it's a structure with starting to the whole organism. Um, next of all, it's a lymphoid system, but more correct, it's a lymphoid organs. A lymphoid organs, why? Because a lymph lymphatic or lymphoid system, it uh, will be in the second semester in the physiology, but uh, really in the uh, lymph organs uh, in the human body, it's a thymus, uh, medulla osseum in the bones, and uh, lium, uh, it's a spleen as a variant, and nodally lymphatic, uh, tonsillae. Tonsillae, I replay, it's a sixth tonsil in the human body. Uh, body in a level of the uh, uh, pharynx, pharynx, nasopharynx, oropharynx, and nodal lymphatici, nodal lymphatici, uh, lymph, uh, lymph uh, nodules, um, it's a capsule or structure in a different regions, um, and uh, in the future you will find this information too. Next of all, 11th, uh, it will be um, nervous system and uh, sense organs, it's a 12. Uh, if very simple for remembering, it's a uh, number, number uh, 12 of the human body and uh, it's the uh, same with the clock, yeah? 
minutes. Uh, here uh, and I replay. Uh, first of all, you will st uh, start team uh, studying of the skeleton. Next, uh, second, it's a uh, two types of the joints. Three, three types of the muscles. Uh, it's a uh, will be smooth muscle, cardiovascular muscle, uh, cardiac muscle. Sorry, and um, second, it's a uh, skeletal muscle. Number four, it uh, will be uh, really uh, digestive tract and starting in this technology. Number five, uh, respiratory system, six organs of the urinary system. Very popular number in the seven, uh, in the genital systems, male and female. Eight, uh, uh, lymphoid or endocrine uh, organs, nine, uh, lymphoid, ten. Cardiovascular 11, it's a, a nervous system. And in the finish, one plus uh, two, three, uh, 3D. For example, it's a sense organs, uh, but it's a not only three sense organs present in the human body. 